Okay. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, did you know that the French-Italian uh, Day for Early Career Researchers has awarded the French-Italian University label for the second year? That's a label for um, a quality label for French-Italian projects with high cultural and academic value. So congratulations for uh, the organization of this event. I am Gaël Caldara, coordinator of the French-Italian University. Thank you for being here with us today. I thank the Association Bernard Grégory for the invitation at this important event for young researchers in Europe. Just a few words about uh, the French-Italian University. It promotes the relations between French and Italian researchers, groups of researchers, and especially young researchers. Uh, it's very important for us to keep strong relations and active collaborations between our two research communities. Uh, and the involvement of young researchers is uh, really encouraged in our programs. Be the future of the European research. Uh, in, uh, at the French Italian University, we have um, six annual or biannual uh, calls for different types of grants. For instance, we have grants for master's double degree programs. We have also three year scholarships for PhD students in joint supervision. We have postdoctoral research grants, uh, grants for international mobility of researchers, of visiting professors. There is also, also the label for uh, conferences, seminars, cultural events, publications, traditions. And finally, we have two award programs. Um, just one more thing, if you need more information about uh, the French Italian University and our programs, you can visit our website. Do not hesitate to contact me if you have any questions. Here is my email address and the email address of my colleagues in Torino. Thank you very much for your attention. I wish you a good event and a pleasant day, and I will hand over to Christina. Thank you very much, Kyle. Um, just to check that um, the chat box should now be working. And um, for the opening, we will continue with Eleonora, please. OK. First of all, uh, thank you for inviting me. It's, uh, it's a pleasure to be here to this afternoon for um, to give my greetings uh, for, to this event. I think that uh, this kind of uh, event can give an idea to PhD students or PhD holders of uh, what happens next. And uh, um, in such a world that becomes uh, smaller and smaller every day, I think that this uh, event um, that point to the cooperation between researchers of different countries should really be the rule in the future. I am uh, uh, Eleonora Bonifacio, as you know from the, uh, the label, <laughs> and I'm the director of the uh, PhD school of the University of Torino. This PhD school is quite big because it includes, uh, it groups uh, um, PhD courses going from humanities to STEM disciplines. So uh, I'm uh, really glad that uh, uh, today um, you will have the opportunity, thanks to the organizers, to listen to the experiences of uh, people coming from very different fields of, uh, of studies. So I'm sure this will be a really fruitful afternoon, and I hope that you um, PhD students and PhD holders will get very useful tips for a bright career in, in the future. I, I want to thank really much the organizers of this event, such, uh, which are Cristina Bercut and uh, Lucia Salto, 
to, uh, as well as uh, uh, the French Italian University and uh, the other organizing parties. Thank you very much for inviting me and have a nice time. Thank you, Nora. Thank you very much, Christina. Good afternoon, everyone. Um, so I would like to take this opportunity to present uh, really quickly ABG and how we can be helpful to the audience. So uh, students, researchers, uh, but also institutions and recruiters. So ABG is a French non-profit organization dedicated to career development and recruitment of um, uh, doctoral students and uh, PhDs, especially outside academia. So we have three main activities. The first one is recruitment. Uh, on our website, we have a job board uh, with uh, offers uh, for internship opportunities, thesis topics, but also uh, job opportunities in and outside academia for all fields. Uh, second, I, uh, we also help, sorry, companies uh, recruit uh, PhDs. Second activity would be trainings. So we give trainings about different aspects of career development, uh, career planning and job search strategy uh, for PhD candidates and PhDs. Uh, third activity is information. So on our website, uh, on, on our social media accounts, uh, through the events that we organize, uh, we give information about mobility opportunities, funding opportunities, testimonials from PhDs who uh, changed paths or testimonials from recruiters to explain uh, why they want to work with PhDs. So all these activities in France and uh, at the international level, especially in Europe. Um, so cross-border activities are especially important for us because research by definition is international and uh, researchers are uh, mobile. And uh, we organize several events, uh, physical on-site events or webinars, uh, workshops, career workshops also with partners, uh, for example, from Germany, Luxembourg, UK, uh, North America. Uh, so these events are very useful in terms of uh, information, but also in terms of networking opportunities. So I hope that uh, this second French-Italian day for early career researchers uh, will be the same. It will help you uh, answer some of your questions and provide you with uh, information, but also collaboration and networking opportunities. So I'd like to thank again, uh, all our partners, the speakers, uh, but also the participants for being here. And I give the floor back to Christina. Thank you very much, Melke. Thank you very much, uh, Nora Gale, for this opening ceremony. Um...